right, this one is on how to grow a travel blog. So if I was a travel blogger or vlogger, um, what I would do to grow it, you know, first of all, you'd wanna put out really good content, um, but then to actually grow that content and get a lot of eyeballs, I would start reaching out and partnering with websites that basically you can buy um, flights from and other websites that even do the same thing as you, right? So I'll give an example. There's a website that I'm actually a subscriber to. Um, it's called Scott's Cheap Flights. And it's pretty cool because what it does is it finds deals, right? So it finds deals for um, uh, flights international um, all over the world, right? So you basically, you sign up, I think it's like 25 bucks a year. It's like super cheap. And then you put where your like main destination or your main location is. And then it will just like every time there's a good deal to other places from that location, it'll let you know, right? So what I would do if I was a travel blogger, I would hit that website up and be like, hey, I have all these blogs and vlogs about these locations. When you find deals on these locations to add more value to your subscribers, put a link to my um put a link to my blog or vlog so that they know what to do when they get there, right? They know how to enjoy the experience of that country. Um, so, so yeah, that's what I would do there. And then vice versa, you could become an affiliate for them, right? So if Scott's Cheap Flights did that for your blog, then you could promote Scott's Cheap Flights um, on your blog, right? So it's, a, it's like an even trade. Um, and then I actually, you know, I think it'd be a little bit harder, but I think it would work too, um, if you reached out to websites that actually like sell tickets directly, um, like Priceline. So I think it would be harder, but <clears throat> excuse me, but it's like maybe Priceline uh, has a blog or something on the bottom of their website and they could point back to yours, right? So, and just imagine there's tons of these websites out there. And then lastly, just to touch on it again, it's like, reach out to people that are doing the same thing. So maybe there's another travel blogger and they've done like all these countries, but they haven't done some that you've done. So you could reach out and be like, hey, do you wanna feature mine on some of these, some of mine on yours? And then I'll feature some of yours on mine. And you could do that with thousands of different blogs, right? And then, I mean, you get the point. So um, yeah, that's how you would grow a travel blog or travel vlog, no money, no risk. Um, just some time and uh, building some connections. So hopefully that was helpful.